is coronectomy a suggested choice when extracting wisdom teeth? So the question is, is coronectomy a suggested choice when extracting wisdom teeth? So first, uh, most of you guys may not know this particular uh, uh, follower. Uh, they really have a specific question about coronectomy. So first, I want to show you guys, you know, what a coronectomy means. So, for example, this wisdom tooth needs to be removed here. And because this wisdom tooth is very close to the nerve, and you guys may see right here, this is the nerve. The tooth is kind of almost passing through the nerve. And the chances of having some kind of a, what we call it as a, numbness on the chin or the lip is high if you are going to end up getting close to the nerve or if the nerve is getting pinched at the time of the procedure. So what we normally recommend we do is not to put any pressure or any type of trauma to the nerve. So we recommend we just cut the crown off as you see here on this third picture right there. So we cut just the crown off. So that's what the word coronectomy means cutting the crown off so coronectomy so so what that coronectomy means is if the tooth is very close to the nerve yes we do a coronectomy procedure and whether it is a recommended procedure or not that depends on the case whether the coronectomy is done on all cases probably not but is it done on some cases yet it can be done if you are a risky candidate to have the whole tooth removed. Thank you. That's very interesting. I don't think I've ever seen it explained that way in the 30 years I've been in dentistry. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs>